you everybody for watching F and Gaming. Now we're going to do the Sony review. We just got done doing the Xbox Showcase. And we're going to compare it to the Sony Showcase? Is that what they called it? No, it is the, uh, the PS5 reveal event. Is it? Stay tuned. Because we can find it. Sit. There we go. Two seconds. Yeah, let's do this. Stay tuned. I tell you what though, I think one thing that nobody compares to the Sony is their presentation, as far as like shows and stuff. I know the the last one they did at E3 was Hi, not super great, but yeah, you're right. But uh, for the most part, dude, the presentations are phenomenal. Who that? Sony. Sony. Sony's always really good. I remember, like, they brought they brought like a band, like a marching band, and like a drum, uh, a drum line, and that was that was awesome. like two years ago, wasn't it? Yeah, and then they brought that guy that played the flute. Uh, it, was, it was not a flute. I can't remember. What it was everybody threw a fit. What was that for? That was for Ghost of Tsushima, wasn't it? The reveal was it? I think it was. That was at E3. Yeah, that was E3. Everybody got mad because when. He sounds like that's a very old instrument. That dude's like one of the greatest in the world. Yeah, and they threw a fit yeah. over it. Come on, yeah, it was one of the great. It was like one of the the best player of that instrument in the world. It's up to you, dude. You can hang out if you want to. That's up to you. Oh no, he says he's gonna be listening. In, in oh, okay. Oh. So I remember seeing that for the first I want to replay it I was so like, bad. Oh my god. Look how That's something that Ghost of Ghost of God of War always got me is the scale. Oh my god, look at that. You hush, no spoilers. So good. Together. So good. For something great. Ghost of Shima might be my favorite game ever. Like they made it specifically. Why did I move here? I guess it was the weather. Or the I guess this is like what well, was Xbox One that was saying that that's not Gears really, of War is no. uh Destiny Two. Destiny Two, yeah. But Destiny Two is going to be on here too, though. So yeah. You sounded more and more. Like, uh, we'll play, I play this game. I play this game. I've bought this game on two consoles. Yes. On two of the same <laughs> PS3 and PS4. It's awesome. It's a good game, though. I mean, it's fantastic. We should PS3, Xbox One. We out here gang banging like it's '91. Did this come out for the 360? I don't think I got it for the 360, but I've also got it on PC. We all love banks. Good game, though. I still, we still gotta do the role play on there. I want to do that so bad. That would be fun. It would be hard to take it seriously, though. This cannot be traced back to me. Champagne, anyone? Champagne, anyone? Champagne. Just sort of smash things. Ready for six to come out, right? They'd be so. Wrong. Like, why wouldn't they? I know. It's been what, two thousand seven? Yeah, eight? like. Oh. I thought I was like, oh. Eve Online. Eve Online is oh, it's a, a freaking universe. Get out of here with your, Alive with with your damn ads. You watch your stupid ads. It's sneaking in here like that. Get out of here, Eve. Nobody likes you anymore. Actually, I think that's a pretty good game, but. <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
Man, that's pretty cool. Plus one million dollars, which buys almost nothing in GTA Online. They do. Uh, the thing on about their online is they money grub a lot. You can still play the game and have fun with it without buying all the stuff. But I was spent like four million on an underground bunker, and I was like, "Yay!" And then there's nothing in it. You still gotta buy stuff <laughs> for the. the stuff I was like, in it. "You son of a bitch!" I stop. I think I stop playing it <laughs> to kick today off with a look back at just some of the seminal moments of the last 25 years. And what better way to bridge our past and our future than with a game that's graced every PlayStation console, Grand Theft Auto. It's Grand been a Auto. privilege partnering with Rockstar Games for many years now, and we're thrilled to open today with the news that that partnership will continue with PlayStation. 5. Dude, you might how much it's material they're gonna have for the next game. Technical details. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this year insane. alone. Like we got a delay. We got more stuff. We got to add. Years. Well, we get to show you. Just some of the games that demonstrate our belief that PlayStation 5 mocks the biggest generational transition our industry has yet seen. The content we've curated for today's event showcases <coughs> how PS5 has inspired developers to create new experiences that are transformative in how they look, sound, and feel. Enough from me. We're going to have the games do our talking. A crane or head. All right, let your games do your talking. Oh, the oh my god! Now, granted, this doesn't have gameplay either, but, but the fact that I played the first one just and I know that what the gameplay is, this is awesome. Dad said that. I love Miles He's too. Right. We still need to set those up too. Your turn. Yeah. Go be a hero, Miles. It could be a hero, Miles, so I can play as you. Okay, let's do this. Be the first Spider-Man game out. You're not playing as Peter. I think. Yeah, it would. I haven't played. Well, I mean, any you played as MJ on the last one. Uh, I MJ. hope they leave that kind of stuff out. Make uh, it purely Spider-Man, like yeah. the whole Mary Jane stuff. Like, granted, it was still kind of fun, but I feel like it took away. Yeah. From. Like, I want to be Spider-Man. I don't want to be Mary Jane unless you give her spider power. Get out of here. Uh, Son of a... Why are you playing ads every two seconds, bro? ads. I'm not buying your product. <laughs> you see yourself out. Advertisements. えっと、今日は皆さんに僕らが作っている新しいグランツーリスモの情報をシェアできるということですごく興奮しています。今回のグランツーリスモはおそらくこれまでのね、グランツーリスモのファンの方がプレイしたら本当に嬉しいんじ
That's gameplay footage, even though it's showing you the car. But I mean, look at that. Either way, it's still footage. Aston Martin. I like how it's on an Aston Martin, gameplay. but if you check the steering wheel, it's a Mazda. <laughs> He's dead. Bump him! Bump him! Tell him. Tell him his boss. That one in front looks like a Batmobile. Yeah, it does. Straight hair. That this hurt. makes me want to buy. I want to buy the. I want to play the game. Get him off. Good job. Good job. Hmm. See, this is so cool looking. Look at them trees. That's not even a black car. I thought it was a black car. The black car? Stop. Get out of here! Get out of here! Helping someone make passive No matter what, like ad blockers or something. Stupid. I can't find my mouse. Yes, you could be helping oh, someone. Stupid like brother. Yeah, see, I, I really want to play. Oh. I don't remember this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Rich and Clink. You all right back there? No way. Appears that the dimensions are collapsing on one another. If we cannot get to get to right the ship, I mean, we can't be that far. I have it in my sight. They have found us, Ratchet. They need a new, uh, oh, I guess I say they need a new Sly Cooper, but that company just literally put like this schema, so never mind. <laughs> Are weakening considerably. See, this is pretty good too. Huh? How bad is it? Huh? Ah! I don't know, Greg. Certainly not good. Great. Where are we? Beats me. Ah! Out of the dragon loose in the city somewhere. Man, me and my brother used to take turns playing Ratchet and Clank on the PS2, and I miss that game. Like I've been wanting a new one for a long time. Yeah, this one this looks fantastic. Fantastic. And they show tons of gameplay footage. Red. Ratchet. We are too late. Ratchet. Who? <laughs> oh no! It's a different universe! That's Rach J. Rach, Rach, Rachel? 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 Hi, I'm Marcus You're ridiculous. Smith, creative director at Insomniac <laughs> Games. The entire studio is so excited to be able to share with you a first ever look at Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart. A brand oh, new guy's eyes. Yeah, eyes. interdimensional adventure built from the ground up for the PlayStation 5. <laughs> We're doing things we've never been able to do before. Like, use dimensional rifts to be able to leap from planet to planet nearly instantly. Or, put ray trace reflections on Clank. All of our alien worlds are filled with density and life previously unseen. Plus, Ratchet's all-new arsenal is more exciting than ever, thanks to the DualSense controller's enhanced feedback. I'm pretty excited Ratchet about that. That is cool. Yeah, they control to our hearts at Insomniac, yeah. and we can't wait to share more with you in the future. But for now, here's another look. Gameplay. Game Already. Gameplay. Lots of it. Look at that. Look at how good that looks. That was pretty cool. He did. <laughs> See that guy? He did. Got sucked into another dimension.
sand shark? Yeah, that's what the little dudes yeah. are called. Was that a kraken? Or at least a, a kraken! Octopus. Release the kraken. I will never get used to that. Hey, to break reality. That's just so cool, man. Right, jump in at you. Jump melee. Melee. Get her. Get her, soldier. Oh. oh, no more. What? The gator soldiers? Rocket soldiers? Oh, I don't remember. Oh, moving particles. Particles everywhere. Like a destructive environment. It's awesome. And particles. Brings back my childhood. Right? It's Insomniac, too. I love Insomniac. In a world, a room. Nice. Should've already been on there. Yeah, I should've done. Oh game. yeah, this looks amazing. Awesome. Just... Look at that. Yeah. Project Athia. <clears throat> he did. Is it Athia or Athia? Huh. Designed exclusively. Exclusively. I granted that is just a trailer. But there's some of those like, hey, get out of here! Way to make money in real get yourself today. out of here! <laughs> Maybe I don't want to do your, your, your webinar. Stupid sunglasses. Who's Chappie? It doesn't matter. That's a good movie. He is okay. Ruben. <clears throat> oh yeah, this game we play the kitty. Stray? Yeah, I think so. In a haircut? <laughs> a bolt cut? <clears throat> Innovation.
Und äh, Yes, I Ultra. Age Runs all the rays. I do dig that controller. At first I didn't like it. I like it. It looks bigger. Yeah. Adaptive triggers. USB port. <laughs> it's a USB in, uh, C instead of a uh, like the old yeah, ones. Yeah. 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 Audio. Here's what I want to know: Are my headphones gonna work for it? Damn Get it. out of here! Get out of here, Eve! Get out of here! Eve! Don't you ah. do the sunglasses and y'all go somewhere. Like, normally it tells you where they're gonna be so you can be prepared. Right? I can't even be prepared. It's a surprise. Making games used surprise to be about these constant trade offs between the Herman Holst. and technical limitations. With PS5, we're not gonna be burdened like that. We're gonna be able to realize our artistic vision a lot better. It's got a ton of horsepower, which is very easy to unlock, and it's a, a machine that's really easy to develop on. The PS5 will present a paradigm shift as to what players will come to expect from gaming. will let us tell stories, make worlds, create gameplay that I think will truly captivate the player and really surprise quite a few people. Please take a look at this new franchise for Worldwide Studios, coming exclusively for PlayStation 5. Oh yeah. <clears throat> it looks interesting. What's that? The movie Tom Cruise. Crash. The attack. Groundhog's Day. Edge of tomorrow. Yeah. The crash. The this is kind of a cool concept. I wonder if, like, when you die, if it does it, like, when you die in the game, you have to do that, or if it's the read. And that you die and do that. Death is no That'd be cool if you actually die in the game. You have to do that. Each time I awake, you know I mean, I don't know. It seems somehow different. Like if it's written, it's written in the script that you die at certain places, or if it counts on becoming part of me. Gameplay. Ah! Don't touch it. Why do you always touch stuff? You go to an alien planet and touch stuff. It's the freaking up. the buttons on the damn controller. Uh, yeah, a pyramid. It's not a pyramid. <sighs> Why do I put what up you, with you? What is it? What Why is, do I put up with you? What is a triangle? Just a pyramid. No, just a pyramid no. Together. Why am I friends with you? <laughs> Furries. Definitely not furries. 
<laughs> Weirdo. Oh, yeah. It's Sack Boy. Sack Boy. <laughs> oh, Sack Boy. I think I tried to play the first one of this. And... Little Big Planet? Yeah. Those are fun games. Yeah. Uh, I think you it's and not... I played it together. Yeah, I think we played a little bit. And super that was good so into long it, ago. Was fun. Yeah. That was before freaking Odessa and everything. Dude, when you think about it, we've been friends for like 16 years. Yeah. The what, 07? What? A long time. Game looks fun. I'm probably not gonna get it. It does look fun, but it's more like uh, I wouldn't even call it a party game. More like yeah. something you play with your kids. Like yeah. I want to play some games, Dad. I'm like all right. all right. Let me turn off Grand Theft Auto. Play this kid a game with you because I love. But I'm also not a platformer. And this is definitely. Not either. The Ratchet and Clank. I'm probably gonna play. The Ratchet Clank looks fun. Heck, boy! I feel like Sack Boy can be kind of fun. <laughs> hey, Sack Boy! <laughs> Get over here! Wax my desk. Dude, this game looks pretty dang fun. I had no... It's like Rocket League... 2. <laughs> like I have Rocket League Deathmatch. No want for this at all. Really? I, I, bet, I bet it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be just like Rocket League. Like, this game looks stupid. I'm gonna play it and it's like, that's so much fun. I, I've been kinda wanting to play Rocket League lately. I don't have to. I suck so bad right now. <laughs> We used to be dope at it. Yeah, we was good at it. Man, this is good. The other was cool though. Like, guys, and then you, it looked like your car explodes, and then you had to maybe run to get another one without getting run over. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Looks awesome. Looks like it's just gonna be fun. That's funny. <laughs> it's very Fortnite-y. Yeah. Let's play Rocket League. Dude, I love Rocket. Oh. You know, Nick, you yeah, say that. Yeah. And then... I'll, I'll be like, well, like, yeah, let's play Rocket League. That'd be cool. Yeah, let's do it, Jake. Let's play Rocket League with Schnick. And then Nick never comes. And then... Where are you at, Nick? And hey, Nick, we're playing Rocket League. That's exactly what's going to be. Nothing. Nothing. It'd be like that one time that Nick said, hey, if you guys want to play tonight... If you can, then I'll play with y'all. And then Nick never shows. <laughs> there gonna be an ad? There not be an ad. I'll be Hello, mad everyone. if there's an ad. Josh Greer, and this is my brother Mike. We're from Ember Lab, a small team with a background in film and animation. And we're very excited today to share with you the first look at our new game. It's a story full of adventure and charm that has themes in personal growth and redemption. So please enjoy. Oh, please enjoy. Did you hear that? Mm. <laughs> That's just like your opinion, man. <laughs> this looks adorable yeah, and I want to like, play it. Yeah, it looks cute. Looks like, uh... I know you are kind. I mean, it's what the... I mean, this is fun. What's the other one? It says the power. That was a game with a little Pikmin. Pikmin. I never played Pikmin. I think I played it on demo at Walmart. And Walmart used to have demos. Driven by the belief that I bet this story is fantastic. Spirits. Oh, 
Fireball. Fireball. You have no power here. Put me in the water now. <laughs> they look like porgs. What's a porg? Porg? I don't know what a porg is. What's a porg? They know might. That game looks like. I like that oh, game. those! I gotcha, I gotcha. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. I didn't Star know that's what Warriors. they were called. Yeah, they look like them. They kind of do look like them. But yeah, that looks fun. Yeah, I'm gonna play that This. I don't know about this one. You ever feel like you're just waiting for a sign? This is straight up like a Life is Strange knockoff. Knockoff. Thing you've always meant to do. Oh, Life this is Strange the, uh... furry edition. Oh. Sometimes I feel like I'm just standing on the edge of doing great things. Volcano High. Goodbye, Volcano yeah. High. Yeah. Like the music, the Something tone. To you're like an hour late, bro. We already seen that. Maybe it's just nerves. Maybe it's the fear that I'll never be as good as what I imagine when I'm still just That's who he was eating. Edge. <laughs> but if we've got nothing <laughs> else to lose, eating some cords. Might as well jump. Make them soups and make them porridge. <laughs> Goodbye. Well, I don't think. It, I don't know. But like. Is that the comet that destroys them? That may be. You know, Life of Strange is kind of a disaster. Yeah, but it is. It might be. Life of Strange is kind of a disaster movie. The end of an disaster era. Game. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. This was, I don't know. I really liked Life of Strange. That game was phenomenal. I beat the first one. I, I never did, did the I second. Didn't play the second one. I was going to. I started playing through the first Hi, one. Atlanta, I didn't finish. And I'm here to share with you a game that I've been trying <laughs> to make. What's a fury? It's an emotionally engaging story where rescuing is rewarding, failure is devastatingly hilarious. And why. And memories should last you Third a edition. <laughs> you ever watched Thirteen Reasons Why? No, but I've heard about it. The Netflix show. Yeah. Shannon liked it. I didn't watch it. Oh. I am this. stoked for this. I am <laughs> I loved these games. My yeah. favorite was uh, Abe's Exodus. Yeah. They believed. They believed. And it led them here. Games are so much. I think we rented Abe's Exodus like 12 or 15 times when I was a kid. For the fate of your entire people. Is up to you. I'm glad they went back to the side scroller too, because they did the 3D ones and I didn't play those. Those are just not... See, I was yeah. curious if they would or not. Like it doesn't bother me because that's the originals. That's what that's what I wanted to do. I don't like the 3D one. I'd like to see an open world one or something. I don't know. I think an open world one would be pretty cool. Maybe open world and switch to side scroller when you get. The... Oh, maybe. I like the side school. It's more charming, I think. <laughs> like, I'm not huge on side scrollers as it is. I'm not either, but this was the one that I really enjoyed. You must find your full voice. Find your full voice. That's exciting. That looks. プレイステーション 
初のゲームプレイ動画ですスーパーナチュラルでミステリアスな東京そこに潜む脅威と美しさを感じ取っていただけると思いますぜひお楽しみくださいThe game where you just played the little man.、Uh, Journey? Journey. That was a PS3 game. Yeah. Look, this kind of reminds me of except for the space stuff. See you later, world. Not enough of your crap. Start over. I think I overall enjoyed the PlayStation Showcase better. I, I think so too. Yeah, that's one of the There's a lot more gameplay, kind of, but. Yeah. We just watched through the, the showcase, the <clears throat> Xbox Showcase. Uh, and we're going to do this one. And then compare, most likely. It just looks fascinating. But Jet so, the Far Shore. It's all called like Dream Games, you know? It's like a. Even though there is a thing out there called Dream Game.、Uh, it's like a dream game. Like, like it's a dream and you do whatever you want? Yeah, kind of. Enchanting, kind of. Well, it's not. <clears throat> Beat him up. Like, this is gameplay. 
instead of a trailer. I would take this over just a trailer any day. Right. That looks fun. Reminds me of uh, Two Human. Play the game on Xbox 360. That was a good game. They must have got it. Hard. It's so hard. Two Human. Yeah. Yeah, it's rough. But oh, this is what this reminds me of. Top about. Godfall. I wonder if that's the people that mean. Very looks very similar. Like the style and everything. Combat. It looks fun. Ink the beast. I'm not huge on this art style. Really? I like it. I don't know about... I mean, I can get why people do like it. It's just... Generally, it's not something I'm into. Game came out. Nah, I'm out. Yeah, I agree. Nick. Bound or something? What is it? I don't know. There's a game that came out where you play like a dancer. It looks just like this, like the same art style. I don't. Oh, is it almost? more green color? I think so. It originally released on the PSP. For the Vita. I want to say bound. I don't know if that's right. Oh my god. This is what I'm stoked about. Yeah, I can't wait for this. I don't oh, even dude. like Hitman, but this. Oh, dude. That's my that's my franchise with their Hitman. No, that's not what I'm talking about. No? I, that made me think of Gravity Rush. All your sacrifice. <clears throat> Only sped up the process. I cannot wait for this. I'm a huge. I didn't pick you up. Too far back. I'm a huge Hitman fan. There you go. <laughs> and now, you find yourself alone. Ready? EJ47 is always alone. Other than Diana. But Diana looks like a death awaits. I love this game. I can't wait. I hope they I release it. I think the last it. one was episodical, though. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I hope they release it at the full game. January 2021, dude. Nice. Were these, these weren't exclusives, though, right? Not originally? I think they originally they were, and I, I think, and then they eventually get, became multi-platform. Is back for his most intimate and professional contract. In the Blood Money is still one of my all-time favorite games. This Dude, is right? also the dramatic no, conclusion for the World of Assassination trilogy. I'm so proud to be here to I present a little glimpse of the gameplay. The Absolution, which is the first kind of, of the new world. generation. In Dubai. That's right. They changed up their game, their game style a little bit. And then the last one that came out was episodically. It was really good. I finally got them when they released them all together. And it was so good. So much fun. Did it have a story? Yeah.
I'm just so garbage at like stealthy games. <laughs> I love it. I'm about hunting humans. It's just so much fun. Creep. Picking on their little nuances. And I like it. I like making them where they just disappear. Blood money is my favorite. Today. Yes, blood money is my favorite. But the last one was really good. Blood money was. And you get to sneak into the White House. I'm guessing that's the sound it's gonna make. <laughs> this I don't care about. <laughs> yeah, I don't care about these I guys don't either. Care about I, I mean, they're they're the cutesy and stuff. And I still don't care about them. <laughs> I don't. They're fun. They're cute. This is not not my thing. They gonna be getting this playing with with. Yes. Nicole. They're fun. Like the, the VR one was really was, was pretty fun. But that might have been just because it was VR and it's one of the first things I played on there. I don't really care about that. Nick, have you turned them both into gamers yet? I don't know, this game looks super weird, but interesting. The forest game that they came out with last year, that was last year. What was it? The game where you play a forest ranger. Same kind of art style. Forest rangers? Firewatch, I think. No, it's not Firewatch. Oh, I know what you're talking Firewatch. about. But it was first person. Was it? I don't yeah. remember. <laughs> Three darts is too much. <laughs> I don't know, see. You're riding on some pink. Horse against you. Okay. Gamers. I'm kind of intrigued by this. Looks charming. Awesome. Oh. That's a dad win right there, Nick. How it starts. See, what you do is you get them all, turn them all into gamers. That way they outnumber. Well, no, because Diana's no. been playing... Oh, she's been playing game? Diana has been playing... <laughs> <That was. laughs> that caught me off guard. I forgot about that. <laughs> anyway, he posted a picture somewhere of Diana playing Animal Crossing. <laughs> Devotees. Really interesting. Little devil. That looks it looks pretty fun, I'm not yeah. gonna lie. I'm gonna have to pick that one up. What's up everyone? I'm sorry. I couldn't care less about this one. Was, oh yeah. Uh, I don't care. I don't know even like two K game. Two K game sucks. The last I hate two K game so much. Uh, even their re their wrestling game is starting to suck now. And what do you mean PS2 starting to? So the whole better. last game was awful. Yeah. Like I don't care. I don't think that thing would have played on a PS3. Don't get me wrong. It, it looks terrible cool. too. It's no gameplay footage. Just one dude doing baskets. That's that's pre-alpha footage. Oh. Look at that sweat. I don't care. It's wet since PS3. I have no want to. Yeah, I don't care. I like the NBA Live. Uh, EA, I hate EA, but I like the NBA Live that they put out. Those were fun. I can't remember the last basketball one I bought. For the most part, I stay away from sports games because they make me so mad. <laughs> I can't stand it. 
Every once in a while, I'll get in the mood and I'll play one. Like, the show or Madden or Live. I think the show would be the NHL. only one that I would play anymore. But I don't even like any of them anymore. Ugh. Oh, God. Here it is. <clears throat> I do with a chance of rain the game do the game I do with a chance of meatballs there's a burger I do with a chance of meatball entirely unique to this island oh this one's lively kill that power I wonder if that's permanent. <laughs> the tune is catchy as hell, though. <laughs> we are whatever we eat. <laughs> I have the rib. Is that a kiwi? That was a kiwi? A water spider. I wanna I would have to work there and name these. My invitation is open. Come join me on the island of Bugs. <sighs> oh, I, um, I was trying to carry a lamp with my weenie, mm -hmm. but <laughs> I agree. The town's on fire. Oh, Again? His weenie hands. He looks terrible <laughs> too. <laughs> he got weenie hands. <laughs> Stupid. This looks terrible too, but I'm kind of, I kind of want to play it. I have no, no want to play this at all. What is this guy? Is the GMO infused foods <laughs> like really, really bad? <laughs> Yeah, I have, I have no I want I'm in, to I, play that at all. I'm interested in it. I don't know if I'll buy it, but I'm at least gonna watch out for you. I'm curious. Nothing else. Hi everyone, thank you for being this guy looks so for this fun. very special like, event. He looks so happy. But before we get to the end of the show, I have something very near and dear to me. Like, I would like to hang him. Who? That guy. Oh yeah, he seems like a great guy. He seems like he's just very a happy, happy person. Happy, happy dude. <clears throat> Bro, I play Animal Crossing. I don't give you a hard time. I don't time. have a Wii, so. <laughs> I don't have a thing. Dude, look how pretty that looks. Dude. Yeah, I know this, this fucking guy. Oh, this ain't what I thought it was. I still don't know how I, I know feel about is, this. This game is a big deal. I know it's a big, big deal. Well, this was I've the, never played the it. original. Yeah, like, like Dark the Souls. original, yeah. And apparently. It's hard. I'm guessing like this game's been kind of in the work. Like say, like it's been rumored, but it come out, but it never does. You know, like oh, they're gonna be, and then it just never comes out. And now it's finally doing it. I know some people saw this. They're like, oh my god! I'm like, excited for it man. to see how far I can get without beating it. <laughs> I never beat Dark Souls 3. The games are just so hard, but they're so much fun. And it's rewarding once you get through a certain part and you actually get to that, that campfire and you save. Like, oh my god, I don't have to do that no more. Like, no people are excited about that. Did game. you play the original? I just never. Destin is a next-gen first-person shooter 
about rival assassins locked yeah, inside this here. This is our unique vision. What arcades are sorry. about. Freeform immersive gameplay, a surreal player-driven story smashed together. Want to see some smashed side action? Up. Check this out. Check this out. Oh really? Hello, Black Reed. Good That's good. The real party I don't know. I don't know about this game. I think this is one I'm too great. Not making this easy. This makes me think of oh, he's peeing. <laughs> oh, what was that game that came out? Uh, I think it was late last year. It's like happy something or Oh other. yeah. It's supposed to be like really big but it turned out to be too good. <laughs> Failed epically. Yeah. And then Dishonored <laughs> like mashed. Yeah. Remember Dishonored? That's when I wanted to I wanna go back and play. Uh, huh? Dishonored. Yeah. We happy few. That's yeah, we happy few. I like this like art style. It's very Rob Rodriguez, Quentin Bethesda. Tarantino I didn't know this was Bethesda. Art time loops fun. For everyone else on this island, this place is paradise. Never it's like the old exploitation movies. Where hunting me is the main attraction. And no matter how I try to escape, they always cut me down. Damn. But I'm one stubborn motherfucker. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be interesting. I, just, I don't know if I'm super excited about it though. Every loop, I'm learning a little more, piecing together the puzzle. There's eight targets, and they all gotta die before midnight. I wonder if it's actually time that would suck. It's time. Oh yeah, I remember the, the I original. Remember this. It's supposed to be like his sister or something. Yeah. Juliana Blake, Black Reef's protector, and a real pain in my ass. She may kill me a million times, but eventually, inevitably, I will break this fucking loop. That loop. I like the Tarantino Rodriguez esque seventies quotation. I kind of like it. I want. I, I think I, I want. It might be interesting. I think I want this. I don't know. I don't know. Definitely uh, keep an eye on for sure. Yeah, definitely watch. See what happens to it. Mainly because of that. I do yeah, I do like the. Uh, uh, oh, the art style's pretty cool. I like killing you. There's a difference. Wait, is it Koa? Is it? No, if it's Koa, that might might be a game changer right there. It would be pretty might awesome. Be a must. Look at that pyramid. Why do I put up with your? Oh, I know what it is here. But the forest greeted them with cold yeah. eyes. Bushes and sticks. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free of mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's brave cries faded fast as the girl ran on. Just a local tale. You're really into that stuff. Quit being so paranoid. No, no, friendly, <laughs> friendly. 
I don't that I don't get. Like how did you How'd you miss? Him? Literally point blank in the stomach. You did. Oh yeah, Resident Evil. Yeah. I like that shotgun though. This looks really interesting. I'm I'm curious as to why or how they would have went from zombies to werewolves, but yeah. I want this. I want this a lot. Yeah. I still need to finish seven. I've been too scared. <laughs> I need to just jump in, like, pull the bayonet off. Yeah, looks really... That looks like it's pretty... Chris? Oh, man! Hey, I think you could. That's exciting. It does. And Chris looks really good in it, too. I kept with the big stocky dude. Instead of, like, the movie where they went with some scrawny guy. I thought this was going to be tiny a arms. See, this I want to know more about. Yeah. <clears throat> That reminds me of like Final Fantasy the movie. Yeah. Where she shoots those things and then they fall on the I can't watch that movie. Some people didn't like it so much because it all the game. I love that. I movie. liked that movie. The kitty. Did you drink? No secret. Not ridiculous. I'm getting like Dead spacey vibes. Yeah. Especially with the mask and then the propulsion just then. So that's pretty cool. That was pretty sick. Or what was he like sucked out of that hole? Pragmata. He's like, well, it. well, she's a robot, what do, what right? Do do uh huh. Well, she's a robot. I think so. Freedom. Our freedom. <laughs> How did we get? Twenty twenty-two. That does look fun. You know what other game I need to beat? Branding. Oh yeah. I um, I was gonna get it. I just never did. <clears throat> PlayStation.
That's cool looking. Dude, I can't wait for this. Perished a thousand years ago. Their great cities turned to graves. In their place came new life. Can't wait. Mm -hmm. I must find a way to stop it. Or we'll get worse and worse. Turtle. Look at a big scary turtle man. I don't need that bird. Until He's looking at it. Us all. nothing I wouldn't do to save this world. No depth I won't explore. No secret I won't unlock. So good. No barrier. I won't cross. This mission is mine alone. If I falter, if I fail, there won't be anyone left to stop what's coming. So good. I like that guy as an actor. Yeah. For home. Horizon. Forbidden, Forbidden West. West. But whatever comes. Influence. What if they had like big battles? That'd be cool. And you gotta like work your work your way through. Yeah. Take down the yellow pumps, like on. Uh, what we'll was that? The Lord of the Rings. Yeah. yeah. We're happy to share the first look at Horizon Forbidden West. We're continuing Elga's story as she moves west to a far future America. To brave a beautiful but dangerous frontier, masked with mysterious new threats. Get ready to explore <laughs> distant lands ravaged by massive storms. And take on new, powerful machines as you return to the majestic world of Horizon. Stay tuned for much more. We can't wait for you to get your hands on it. Ooh wee! I think there's a lot to look forward to for the community. Big fans are going to be really pleased. As a game designer and storyteller, this is incredibly exciting. We're talking a whole new generation of ideas and experiences that we can create. For and Von Drag. No matter where they are, no matter who they are. New experiences like we've never had before. More Ooh. iconic, interesting characters, more atmospheric, immersive worlds for players to explore. We want to wow players. It's the unexpected. And I for one can't wait. You can't wait. We can't wait to share them with you. It's, it's so exciting. Incredibly exciting. It's really about As a developer, that's an amazing feeling to have. Welcome to PlayStation 5. We can say it should be on the console. Yeah.
I seriously hope they're not over five hundred dollars. I wouldn't. Maybe like the may have like a big version of it, like memory and stuff like that. Two versions. Oh yeah, but they always have like. I don't think I'm doing that with this. Really? Not a release there. Right? That's one six. I like so the look. I like the white and black too. I'll be like, I wish it was just black. No, I like the white and black with it. I think if you swap the colors, it still look cool. Yeah. I like that. I like that version. That's the one I want. I really hate that they're going to discless stuff. Yeah. I'm a physical copy kind of person. A little bit of both. It just depends. I, I like to have physical contact with with my games. Like, know that I own them. So if it's a game that I know that we're gonna play a lot over the years, like Ark. That one out of my digital <laughs> copy. I miss Ark. I do too. You can bring some of the videos over here. Do what? Some of our videos on from Ark. Yeah, I mean, I know the password. I do. I can do it without it. Just screen record it. The one in particular I know when they were playing Ark, we were climbing my giant ladder. The one with Whitey? Yeah, I love that, dude. So bad. I really dig the controller. I didn't at first. I like I it. I guess the more I see it, the more I like it. There's my question. Is all of this going to come with the console or am I going to have to pay yeah, for it separate? Yeah, that's true. It's going to be a yet. I don't care for what? the remote. Just give me two controllers, the camera. I don't even really need the headphones as long as these headphones, the headphones are, are going to work with the new system. Yeah. Well, I like Because that sucks. I them, but I like them. When I went from the PS3 to this, I had to get new headphones. Yeah. It was terrible. I've seen games that can only be enjoyed with the full range of PlayStation 5's features and power. At PlayStation, we believe in generational transitions, and we put years of work into making them happen. We want you to enjoy the unique benefits of moving from one generation <coughs> to the next. Thank you for joining us. We're launching later this year, and we have tons more to share. Welcome to PlayStation 5. Mm. It was so good. I do like that they kept with the same kind of name and stuff with it. Yeah. Simple. Fucking Xbox is dumb. Spider-Man. Go from the Xbox to Xbox 360. No, no. <laughs> the Xbox XS Series 4 or 7. Never comes. Dumb. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to watch out for. Yeah. I don't know in the if coming the coming months. Like, that's not one of them. Not that one for sure. <laughs> I want to know what all comes with it. Because with the Xbox, it literally just shows console and a controller. Yeah. Whereas this one, headphones, a Would remote. You they gave you all that stuff for $500? Dude. Or even $600. They'd win. Yeah. At least the launch. Oh, dude. Hitman. Mm, I can't wait. I'm Hitman on PS5. Can't wait. Look, sex. Sucks, snakes. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Look at it. I don't really care about that. The next gen is, is definitely exciting. Yeah. Both consoles. I think I'm leaning towards the PS5 first, though. I am, though. too. 
in between the two right now. Even with the second Xbox One, I think PS Five. Yeah, this PS Five event still overshadowed the new Xbox Showcase. I watching them back to back. Mm-hmm. They had plenty. They had a few. They had a few just trailers, which is fine. That's cool. Uh, showing some trailer, just trailer stuff to get you excited about a game. Let's go. This was interesting. They had plenty of gameplay footage for the games coming out, especially the bigger ones. That one is a deal. Uh, what makes it for sure? And plus, just I don't know I, the games that are coming out. Sony, the the even the ones that they just showed the trailer look more interesting. Yeah. I, uh, some of the Xbox ones look like they had some really good stories, and that looked like they had some innovation. But man, it's just hard to compare to that. Man, that's just awesome. Well, there's a few there that I don't care about the the furry. And your life is strange. I don't care about. Goodbye, volcano, huh? Yeah. You couldn't just remember that. No. I mean, that, I mean, I mean if it's like super cheap, I might, I might check. care less about a twenty-one. What's next? <laughs> I'm just curious about that game. I do not want bug snacks. <laughs> we're gonna get one. I'm not playing bug we're, snacks. We're gonna get. We're what gonna happened? Stream it. That was weird. We're gonna stream. We're gonna stream bug snacks. I'm not. I'm not playing bug snacks. And Jake's gonna have French fries. I already have these fucking <laughs> tater tots. But uh. So, I think there's maybe three or four for the Xbox that I'm really intrigued about. But there's a lot more for the PlayStation. Yeah. So, I'm thinking on launch, most likely will be PS5. As it stands, that wins my money. For me, definitely. If I can only buy one, and I'm probably only going to be able to buy one, hands down right now. It's because... Even the like, even the Gran Turismo game. Like, I'm not a, I don't, I don't like racing games. But, yeah, man, that game looks amazing. I have to, I might have to get that one. Play me what racing is going game. on here? So interesting. I don't know. We'll just have to see where we're at in what is July. Probably come out around Thanksgiving. Yeah, so, so four time more months. For Black Friday or uh, nah, yep. called Blitz. Not called Black Friday anymore. That's racist. That's I have racist. no idea. I mean, I'm not. Gonna, I don't participate. I don't either. I don't feel like getting beat up over a fucking 13 inch television. All right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The whole, just the list of what's coming out. Either way, whatever you're going to get, whatever you're leaning towards, the next generation is going to be awesome. It's just. I have no doubt. I need a console. You know, wait. What are you going to get? Plans. What system are you leaning towards? That's just me. I'm more, like I said, I'm more of a Sony person anyway. I love Xbox. I think they've got some great games. Console. But I grew up playing Sony. That's just me. The games that they have, they're self-tailored a little. My taste. And Xbox. For me personally, I think. Oh, I feel like 
I've always been like, yeah, new Xbox. Like, I'm going to get it. Now I'm like, it looks cool. But I've already played the games that are coming out for it. So I'll get it later. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely don't think I'm going to buy either one at launch. It might be maybe January before I... Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. I do like that. Granted, it's only one generation back, but <clears throat> the um, backwards compatibility for the PlayStation. Yeah. Whereas for the Xbox, it does go all the way back. Yeah, to, that's a that's a big deal too. To the beginning, which would be fantastic if Sony would do that. Uh, yeah. I have I don't know why they so many games. I mean, I know they. That have I would like to just pop in store. and play. I know there's the that's not what I'm PlayStation saying. Store still has. I own these games. I I don't want to pay for them again. Usually pretty cheap though. Either Unless. way, I'll pay for them again. Three years. <coughs> that game was awesome. Game was fantastic. <clears throat> Pretty much all we got for today. We're going to have a special two-parter weekly plug-in. going to be, uh... This week. Yeah, I didn't even think episode. about that. Look on for it on the... You... On YouTube. Yeah, look for it on the YouTube. YouTube. And, uh... Yeah, we appreciate everybody stopping by and for the feedback. Or, uh, watching, yeah. That's Let it. us know what you think uh, is going to be your console of choice. Uh, what games you're looking forward to? And uh, as always, we're FN Gaming. You too. Yeah. <laughs>